Hey guys, Big Daddy Hoffman 1911 coming to you today. We got all the targets painted up here and everything. And I guess we're going to mess them up for something very cool right here. The Vepper. So I say it's Vepper time. Let's put this thing on the table, tell you a little something about it, and have some fun with it. Let's get it done. Okay, here we go, guys. All right, do your thing, buddy. Russia. That's sweet. So here's the Vepper. Uh, everybody knows about the Vepper. Um, it's got a self-regulating gas system that, that kind of makes it uh, shoot all kinds of 12-gauge uh, shotgun shells. So it, it, in, in the uh, competitive shooting world, uh, I guess unless you have a highly tuned Sega, uh, people are leaning more towards the Vepper. Right? Yep. And as it comes in, you're going to get a five round magazine and it's going to look pretty much like this. The reason we're doing this video right now is we got some cool new uh, accessories uh, from SGM Tactical that we're going to put on here. And uh, just at the SHOT Show this year, uh, they announced a new version that's going to be coming in that doesn't have this folding stock on it. It's just going to be a straight tubular stock. And get this, the MSRP on them is $7.25. So you're going to see them online in the uh, $6.99 range. And for a shotgun like this, uh, you really can't beat it. Now the only downfall is that it does come with that five round magazine, but do we have the solution for that? Yes, we SGM do. SGM Tactical, US made uh, 10 and 12 round magazines for the uh, for the Bepper, and we've got this cool muzzle brake on here. This is the Saber Boss. Now it's threaded with the exact same thread uh, pattern as the Segas, so any Sega attachment. Uh, for for the end of the barrel that you have already laying around or you find online will fit on this so This is a uh, machine made in America, and we're just gonna pop that on there and That just says big daddy Hoffman doesn't it that's what I'm talking about Yeah, makes a big difference sure it does And we don't even can't even find that five round magazine anymore. There you go. So, 10 round magazine. So if you guys order one of these, with the money you're saving, you're definitely gonna wanna invest in some uh, higher capacity magazines. Now SGM is supposed to be bringing a, uh, a drum magazine to the market fairly soon. And uh, as soon as we get our hands on one of those, we'll show you guys how that runs. Uh, so we're gonna be running some uh, Winchester AA, uh, three, 1300 feet per second. Uh, and this should run uh, lower quality shells, but this is a great, we have uh, had tremendous success with this particular ra round and uh, semi-automatic shotguns. That's a three and a quarter dram stuff, so that'll, that'll do fine this one. Yeah, this is built like a tank. It's built on an RPK uh, receiver there. All this is original Russian um, uh, hardware, and that's going to come in the new ones as well. So it's, it's a pretty cool setup. And for the price point, you really can't beat it. All right. All right, let's see how it runs. Let's do it. All right, let's make some noise. All right, unlike the uh, Sega, uh, it, these magazines are going to slide in kind of like an uh, AR. There you go. Huh. Here we go, 10 rounds. <laughs> it's, it's hefty, uh, 8.9 pounds, I believe, is, the, uh, is what's listed on the weight. Yeah. You definitely feel like you're holding on to something. Yeah, I love that shotgun. Let's load it up and see how fast you can put it into the gun. Man, think? don't you love the smell of that? Yeah. <laughs> Nothing like the smell of gunpowder on Sunday, right? Yes, sir. All right, let's go load it up. All right, let's rock and roll. Have some fun, guys. That's ready. I'm ready. All right, here we go. All right, come to the side, buddy. Let me let's let them rip. All right. <laughs> I tell you one thing. I do like your shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> I put a smile on your face right there. Yes, sir. Make it grin like a mule eating briars, you know? Oh yeah. Gotta load it back up. Let's go. <laughs>
Yeah, here goes my freshly painted targets, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> All right, what you gonna go for? The poppers here, buddy? Yeah, let's just make a mess. Just make a mess? Yeah. I got plenty of paint. All right, let's do it. It's smoking. I'll tell you one thing. It does feel good, doesn't it? Yeah. Did you bring yours? No, I don't have one. Anybody's anybody's got one of these. Oh man! <laughs> let her back up. All right, let's give it another round, buddy. Let's drop this whirly gig. How's that? All right. All right, whirly gig by MGM. You know, oh, what's the name of these other little? The tooth and nail. Tooth and nail target. Yeah, they're pretty cool too. All right, here we go. Got a little flinch there. Yeah. Well, I'm glad I'm glad I had a handheld magazine. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're not supposed to laugh like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's it's probably the sights. They're probably off, right? Yeah, I think that one target was uh, that one was rusted inside the holder. That's possible. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, I enjoyed shooting this one, and we're going to shoot some more here off the camera. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and if you did. Please like, favor, and subscribe. We're going to list what information we have underneath the video on this fine shotgun. I, I recommend it 100%. Also, uh, information and links on the, the magazine and uh, any more information underneath the video. So check that out. Guys, also, remember to keep up the fight again. Gun control. Um, because, you know, it's election year and it's very, very important. Join and support the NRA. Do everything you can to fight for our freedom here. All right, guys. As always, remember, Big Daddy loves you. Hoorah. Take care. Let's go shoot some more. All right. All right.